<laughs> gang, gang. Buzz, buzz. That's hairspray, you goon. <laughs> Get your life together. It is. Idiot. Don't touch me, bro. I'm not touching you, dude. The greatest show on earth. Dude, you got to tidy up sometimes, you know? You got to keep tidy. <sighs> dude, and I'm not just talking about our beautiful hair piece. I'm talking about below. Yeah. I'm talking about your nut sack. Oh, yeah, I'm talking about body hair, nut hair, wiener hair, hair around your body. Yeah, give it that Philly fade. Give it that nice bald fade. Yeah. You feel me? Cornrow your nuts. You feel me? Do something nice for yourself. Show but do it right. Do yeah. it right. Do it with Manscaped. Re yeah. Redesigned electric trimmer. Their lawnmower 2.0 has a skin-safe technology, so this trimmer, it won't, it won't cut your sack, dude. Yeah, don't be down there with a switchblade. You know, you've been up all night doing a couple grams or whatever, and you break out a switchblade to tidy up your patch. Don't be that freaking bad hero, dude. That's a bad idea. And your nuts bleed. When you nick those things, they bleed, yeah. man. Your nuts have other people in them, dude. Take care of your body. Yeah, they also got the crop preserver, which is a deodorant, just like your armpits, but for your nut sack. Yeah, you think your nuts don't stink, boy, hanging out with your wiener all day? You're an idiot. God dang, you're an idiot. Yeah. Get 20% off and free shipping with the code CATS at manscaped.com. Always use the right tools for the job. Your balls will thank you. Yeah, dude, you wouldn't take a cannon into a painting contest at a children's school, would you? Dude. Use the right tools for the job. Get 20% off and free shipping with the code CATS at manscaped.com. Forget about it. That's 20% off with free shipping at manscaped.com. I just said it. Use cats. Trying to keep the lights on. It's 2019. I can't believe we can't do things like paint our teeth and do unique things to ourselves. Yeah, I hear you, man. I hear you. I hear it. You know what's even scarier yeah, than what? all that? You know what? what's scarier than that? Shopping for life insurance, dude. Yes. That's how I'm going to button this up. The idea of looking for life insurance is so scary. Oh, man. The other day, I was looking for something, dude. And just stopped, right? Oh, I got so scared because it was life insurance. Me too. Thank God for PolicyGenius.com. Oh. It's an easy way to shop for life insurance online in minutes. You can yep. compare quotes from the top insurers to find your best price. Yep. Think about somebody. Think about yourself. All Think about dying. Yep. It's going to happen. So what we're saying is policy <laughs> genius, baby. Yes. Once you apply, the policy genius team will handle all the paperwork and red tape. All right? Yep. They make it so easy for home insurance, auto insurance, disability insurance, everything. Life insurance, death insurance. Here's the thing. Don't be that creep that dies and doesn't leave a couple of, you know, a couple G to her mom or her stepmom, you know, or surprise the ex-girlfriend with a couple grand, you know? Yeah, don't you die stole and leave half two of her Oreos. Shit. Yeah. You feel me? He stole half of her shit, bro. Drop her a couple of G. Be that fucking hero, bro. Yeah, be a hero. Be a life hero. Yeah. This October... It doesn't have to be scary, man. Mm -mm. Buy life insurance with Policy Genius. Go to policygenius.com, get quotes, and apply in minutes. Mm -hmm. You can do the whole thing on your phone right now. Policy Genius, the easy way to compare and buy life insurance. That's right. Die like a champion, son. Policy Genius. Support the podcast. Now, nah, someone had a fingernail on the table. A We're trying to figure out who did it. Big one, too. Not mine. Not <laughs> mine. I got the fingers of a pianist or somebody or somebody looking for something real small in a basket. <laughs> Good at pickpocketing, huh? Yeah. Maybe good at magic? Huh? Maybe good at magic? Yeah, maybe. You can't have fat fingers and be good at magic. You could. What nah. are you drinking? This? A little sparkling water. Sparkling water from what, bro? <laughs> Is it natural? I guess. <laughs> what do you mean? Do you drink anything, Natural bro? mineral water, bro. <laughs> oh, my God, bro. Yeah, if it's cold, I'll drink it, bro. Oh, my God. If it's cold, bro. you put it in front of me, I'm down in it. Dude, I'll put, I'll put, I'll put some, some ice on my nuts in, bro, and serve you up a refreshing batch, dog. You got to calm down. You can't just honey drink roasted anything. roasted nuts, bro? What's up? No, I'm just saying you can't drink out of a... You can't, who drinks water out of a metal can? Dude, that's what they threw my way, so what? I drank it. Dude, I feel like you're on a different vibe. Who you're, did? I feel like you are on a different vibe because you came back from Hawaii. Now, I, I will say this. You got the sun-kissed skin. I'll give you that. You look good. You look good. You been surfing? Huh? Maybe hanging out with some pineapple honeys? Nah. Had a good time, man. Had yeah. fun. Mm -hmm. Little Lilo and Stitch action? Uh, no, I didn't see any animals. I'm trying to think if I saw any or not. Maybe uh, a Lilo and bitch? Uh, no, dude. I don't call women bitches, dude. It's because they're females. Well, it depends. Um, I mean, there's some bitches out there. Yeah, but... especially in Hawaii. They got attitudes. Am uh, I right? What? No. Uh, no. <laughs> No, you're left, Do you eat a little dude. tuna? Huh? Do you eat a little tuna? Yeah, I eat it, all of it, bro. 
Bro, yeah. you do. You fall asleep with your mouth open and a fish will swim right into your mouth. Bro. Hell yeah, that fresh catch. Oh, it's like that, dude. Do you it's eat crazy. some of that spam too? You look like the guy like spam. Uh-uh. Oh, I've had spam before, but not. Spam and uh, what else? I haven't ice. had it in about 18 years. Spam and shaved ice, bro. That's Hawaii. Dude, it was great. I was in Maui, first of all. So don't sound like well, a Well, that's frickin'... Hawaii, bro. Well, don't sound like a filthy casual hey, dog. there's nothing okay? worse than what island. I don't give a fuck. Yeah. They all look the same. <laughs> yeah, if you don't Maui, give a Maui. If you don't give a fuck. Hawaii. Then you end up on any island, bro. That's okay? right, dude. Yeah. I, I, You'll end up on Staten Island, dude. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> Drinking pina coladas. I went to Catalina Island. Thought it was... That is Hawaii, yeah, bro. There you go. Short flight. That's why you don't know what it's like, boy. Boy, I've been there. Come it was on. good. You, have you been to Maui? I've been to Maui. I've been all over. Hawaii's my favorite place to go. Oh, hold dude, on. Favorite I've place been to go. all over Vegas term. <laughs> dude. <Okay. laughs> well, you're That's the guy. So what island? All right. Guy, hey, you've been there once, bro. <laughs> Came back with a Hawaiian shirt looking like Hawaii 5 0. All right. Chill out, dude. Chill out, man. I've been there a bunch. No, you haven't. It's my favorite place to go. Here's why, dude. Okay. Hear me out here. Short flight, yeah, kind of exotic, yeah, zero terrorist, yeah, no ISIS, yeah. The worst thing that's gonna happen, you jump on a wave when the locals whip your ass. That's it. Yeah, that's a pretty good call. <laughs> yeah, I had a good time, man. I went to this place, Paia, it's called, and just hung out, man. Just chilled by chilled yourself. Chilled out. Yeah. Did you surf? Uh, nope. This guy was gonna teach me to surf. This guy named Ian Walsh. He's like a famous surfer, but I didn't get to meet up with him. Why not? Uh, I already had some classes and stuff that I was going to. I was already. So it was just like last minute. Did you go in the water? Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You got yeah. to, bro. Oh, I went in the water. Little sea turtle. Dude, I was in there. There's all kind of stuff in there. It's beautiful. Ain't the best, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. It's great. You came back refreshed. I don't know about that, Brendan. Really? All right. Are you in a bad mood? Flirt with not, me. Did you no, not I'm not in a bad <laughs> mood. Well, it's good to see you, though, man. I was in Denver. I was in Denver, dog, hometown. How was it? Good? It was good. A little stressful playing, playing for your mama, playing for your papa. I get some bits that are pretty racy as the kids call it oh really yeah so it's awkward doing in front of your dad yeah it's awkward doing in front of your dad doing in front of your mom Derek was there oh i love your dad now my dad loves you oh really? man his dad got black as shit when i met him dog it was awesome <laughs> his dad's real urban my he dad's started talking urban. about collard greens with me out of nowhere my dad's wow. urban start talking about hot that's sauce collard greens racial I that's thought. what i said i said dad i'm gonna have to ask you to leave yeah he's like oh man you're a fucking hater <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I don't really? know why you're. At, I don't know why you're acting like that. <laughs> He's like, Derek, you be hooping, bro. I said, Oh, he all did. Right. Yeah, you be hooping. <laughs> and then I was like, Dad, you gotta leave. Like, all right, where them hoes at? I'm like, I don't. You're married to my did stepmom. Really? Please don't do that, Dad. Wow. Yeah, I got very strange. Very strange. What was it? Why did he have an attitude? Well, was he grew up on? around all black black dudes. He did. I've never seen that side of him. <laughs> he grew up slanging weed. That was his side hustle. Oh yeah. In in, in high school, he got kicked out of high school. Really? Graduated eventually. Shout out to my dad, Regis High School. Um, Regis High School? Yeah, all boys. I thought it was a hospital, isn't it? Uh, I think so. Did your dad go to high school at a hospital? <laughs> that makes a lot of sense right now. <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. Yeah. But yeah, he grew up around a lot of black dudes, and that you just brought it out of him, man. man. It came wow. out of his spirit, dog. Yeah, it's, it, the, his real... His real like spirit came out. Boy, I, said, I, I, I do. That's what he said? <laughs> yeah, he did. And they did this real cool handshake. I was like, what the fuck is happening? Then he starts sagging his pants. Oh my God. <laughs> That's crazy. I know, man. man. Then my mom had a way too many wobbly pops, started kissing my friend on his neck. Oh, really? She was drinking? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. My mom fancied herself. A, a lot cool. of mountain drunks up there. Yeah. And we, and we ain't talking about that Mountain Dew either. No. You feel me? A lot of air drunks, too, dude. That thin air up there. Oh, that'll dude. get you wobbly, man. Oh, somebody hopped up on a couple of lungfuls of fucking inhale, and next thing you know, they're breaking into your car. Dude, I took <laughs> I took one hit of this, uh, whatever D had. You know, it's high altitude. You forget, you get higher in high altitude. Was it marijuana? The Mary Jane. Oh, legal really? out there. Mm -hmm. Be cool, man. You it's smoke legal. marijuana? Oh, I Does smoke he? A lot. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, yeah. You're looking at a freaking Snoop Dogg over there. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's ridiculous. I'm we shared a condo. I walked in like... Hey, Cheech and Chong, can you chill out for a second, man? We got you so high, bro. Oh, I really? took, one, took a I lot took, of it? Dude, oh, I yeah. took one puff, keto, not that night, got an entire Pudge Brothers pizza in my underwear. Yeah, dude. Derek, he pizza in his underwear watch me eat the minutes. entire Pudge Brothers pizza in my underwear. Was it a good pie or not? I was so high, it could have been pumpkin pie. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Which is also a good choice. That's not a good reference. You're right. Yeah. Shout out to Pudge Brothers. Is that what it's called, Pudge Brothers? Yeah. Oh, wow.
And are the guys actually bigger guys, the brothers? Or are they? You know, I've never seen them. Hmm. We should rename this show Pudge Brothers. Although you're looking, you're looking thin, dude. I'm fucking that Hawaiian lean, shirt, dude. Lean, bro. Maybe button up one of them though, huh? <laughs> like, you're on, you're not, <laughs> hey, Mahala, bro. You're that guy. Oh, I'm sorry, dog. The bounty hunter. <laughs> How are you doing, dude? Bro, my Those eyes are up here. Okay. <laughs> My bad, dog. The bounty hunter with my all the extra jewelry. Here, shit. Bro. This ain't jewelry. Are you gonna bro. track down Derek for stealing the other day? <laughs> this is Island Charm, dude. Island Charm. Yeah, dude. All right, bro. Go give me a spam sandwich, bro. <laughs> oh, I miss man. you, man. I feel like we haven't been in here for a while. Really? Yeah. I texted you once. Said, "Hey, dude, excited for King of the Sting." Text back, bro. <laughs> Nah, man. Yeah. Send me a picture. Send me a picture when I wake up like this. I knew I was going to see you. With your shirt off like this, dude. Be cool. Bro, I We're wanna, friends. Well, I knew I was going to write a lot of stuff, and I didn't want you to fucking be strained, you know? Yeah. Did you buy a bunch of Hawaii shirts out there? Let me see. What did I do, man? I can't even really remember. What did I do? I just chilled out, and what else, man? Went in the water. Um, I saw you picked up a hitchhiker. Yeah, I picked up a hitchhiker over there. Uh, now, see, it was confusing because it looked a little bit like Yellow Wolf. Uh, no, no, no. The this guy, guy was out to lunch a little bit. <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> no, he was still having. Also, are you trying bro. to die? Huh? Are you trying to die? Dude, I love hitchhikers, man. I, you know, I used to hitchhike when I was young, and it's something you can't really do here that much anymore because everybody's so. Oh no, no, no! You know why you can't do it? Huh? Because they murder people. <laughs> Not all of them. Yeah, bro. Not all of them, dude. I didn't get murdered. Well, because you had a, because you had a camera on the guy, so he didn't want evidence. No, I told him right when I got in. I was like, I'm just doing this just in case, you know. And he's like, Yeah, I think because that's the thing when a hitch when a when a when a hitcher gets in, they don't know. It's you know, I'm saying somebody's got to be the murderer. It's yeah, like it a, could be you. Yeah, could be him. Yeah, but we know you're not a murderer. Well, so it could be him. But you don't know if you're a murderer until you pick up a hitchhiker. Also. <laughs> You're right. You, when you're right, you're right. Sometimes I want to f- murder a few Uber drivers. They won't shut the fuck up, will they? Yeah. I swear I checked on the thing, no talking. You did? Every time. They, Damn, they, they ignore it and they power through it. <laughs> they power through it. They power through it. Dude, that could, that could be a good idea for a podcast. Just what random hitchhikers. You got audio set up. You just find out about these people. Yeah. This guy was great. He said he'd been hitchhiking for five years. This guy, Josiah, was his name. Straight out the Bible, too, dog. If oh, they get in with a biblical name, dude, you got to give them a ride, you know? Yeah. Some guy gets in, he's like, oh, my name's Noah, you know? My boat broke down. You're like, all right, bro. <laughs> Come on up, in, dude. You, know? <laughs> you got it. You that know? guy that you picked up didn't look like he did drugs at all. <laughs> oh, like, the whole God. island does drugs. They do. They have a meth problem. They call it ice. No, it's not I ain't meth, talking about shaved it? ice. Oh, yeah, bro. I don't think oh, so. Oh, meth in Hawaii is big. Is it? Oh, big. How are you going to do meth and be out like at the beach? That sounds crazy. You're there all day. Yeah. You're wiling out, dude. They did have some people that were living on the beach, you know? Dude, you should have picked them up and then pretend it was cash cap and start asking random questions and not pay them. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't that be dope? I'm just fucking with you, man. Have a good day. Dude, what about crash cab? You pick them up and then crash into something. And see... <laughs> <laughs> Or you or slash cab, you pick him up and just listen to Guns N' Roses the whole time. <laughs> Name that tune. Yeah. Like he's gonna win money. <laughs> That'd be dope, man. I don't think it'd be that great, actually. I feel like it's a good idea. I feel like you would r- kill that. A you little do? show like Cash Cab, but you're just picking up random strangers. Cause you don't shut the fuck up anyways. So you just <laughs> really? like keep talking to them. Dude. Cause you got you got a lot of knowledge to drop, man. So I feel Whoa, like you could pi- I, I'm saying you could pitch up like Yeah, what are you saying? Anyone who's hitchhiking. Probably not doing very well, you know, because there's Uber now. <laughs> so I feel like if you... <laughs> but hitchhiking is... Hey, isn't that... Uber hitchhiking? <laughs> yeah, <no. laughs> yeah. Basically, yeah. Yeah. But there's like documents. There's like just where, you know, there's proof of where you've been at, I guess. I don't know, dude. We had a new culture corner today. Ooh. Yeah. Chappelle Lacey. Chappelle Lacey's hey, in cool. the house, man. <laughs> Look at him, man. What's up? Look at him. Yeah. Dang. One of my favorite people. Nicest guy in the world. Really? Man. The nicest guy in the world. I am really nice. Yeah, well, you that. had an anger problem, I, so I, let's yeah. be cool. <laughs> oh, yeah, anger uh, problem, dude, you dude. have to go to anger management for how long? Uh, years. <laughs> 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 years. Uh, Damn. High, high school and college. Damn. I know. Dude. When when did you realize you had a problem? 
Bro, I didn't realize they told me, motherfucker. Come on now. Really? Oh, He's yeah. angry right now. Yeah, you don't, hey, angry? Please, please don't hit I know, me. yeah. I'm uh, sorry. That was aggressive. I'm sorry. I'll hey, chill out. Please don't throw vans at me. I know, right? Um, that was aggressive. <laughs> I'll call. I'll How are you going to hang ready for fucking years? <laughs> Yo, why'd it take Damn. years? That's crazy. Because it doesn't stop. Yeah, it's only dude. there. It doesn't fucking stop, you little pussy. You need to go to anger, you need to go to anger, yeah, anger you need management, to fucking dude. End up in a it's fucking fun. Alley, boy. Yeah. Yeah. It's fun? Mm-hmm. But uh, here's the other thing about Chappelle. You probably didn't know this, Theo, nor do you care. He was a uh, cheerleader. I know that. Male cheerleader. I've seen him do a round off back handspring, dude. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, I've done more than a round off back handspring. Thank you very much. Come Sorry. on now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. I'm not a minimalist, okay? <laughs> <laughs> How are you going to be a male here? cheerleader with an attitude problem? Uh, I'm a gangster. <laughs> be what? cool, bro. Oh, yeah, sorry. Gangster, I, keep being, I keep being aggressive. Yeah, I'm you, sorry. Dude, you got to work on your... Dude, he's got daggers in his pom-poms. That dude's... <laughs> <laughs> he got Chinese dude, stars in his pom-poms. That'd be such a great superhero. <laughs> Be dope. <laughs> oh, yeah. that would be cool. They're also called Power Rangers. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true, true. Power true. Rangers are all cheerleaders. I'll be the Pink Ranger. Damn. Oh, I don't care what. It's just a color. Sure, man. Sure, yeah. buddy. All I right. know that was aggressive too. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. I need wow. to tone it down. You know, get the mic out of my face. All right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we need to talk to your uh, supervisor. Yeah. Wow. Culture Corner's getting thick, brother. Yeah, it is thick over there, huh? Mm-hmm. Thick with three C's. Oh, in a good way, though. <laughs> yeah. In a good way. I'm only talking to Derek and uh, Chappelle. <laughs> Cat, please don't sue me. Hey, I'm on keto. Are You're you not- really? <laughs> Damn. Dude, he uh, went to Portland with me. He went to Portland with me. With his diet, I went, dude, you should try keto. He goes, yeah, I'm down for that. Meal comes. <laughs> He gets a giant burrito, two muffins. Like, yeah. well, damn, dog. It was something crazy. <laughs> he said, I'll start when I get back. Yeah, that's what I'm that. saying, man. That. That's what I'm saying. Reincarnation, dude. Eat what you want in this life. Start when you get back. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about, dude. Chappelle headlined his first weekend. Did yeah. you? Where He's at? going to this week. Yeah, uh, House of Comedy, Minnesota. Oh, wow. October 3rd through 6th. I know, like Thursday, Six Friday, Saturday, yeah. and Sunday. Yep, Dang, you get them long weekends. Yeah, right? it, this is my first headlining weekend. Is ever. it? Yeah. No. Oh, congratulations. Yeah, man. I'm excited. I'm proud I'm of you, excited. man. Thank you, guys. Thank four you. nights, huh? Yeah. In the mall, huh? In that mall. Dude, the mall's crazy. They have four American Eagles in there. And for true. real? And yeah. they have real someone's found a real American Eagle in there one time. <laughs> I mean, no, for real. There's yeah, yeah, there's, there's birds flying around. There. There's oh. peacocks. Yeah. I rode a hippo. <laughs> How big is it? It's big. It's the, bro. it's the biggest mall in America, but the biggest is in Edmonton. Same place though. It's the exact wow. same mall, same owners. Yeah. Bigger. Wow! And they're building they have a shooting range in the one in yeah. Edmonton too. They got a shooting range. I'm they have an amusement shoot. park. You can go in. You can go in over there. They have there an amusement like park in that bitch. Yeah, they do. They got rides, pirates. It's crazy. Man. Y'all been to Paisley Park? Nah, man. Oh wait, yeah, that where uh, Prince is from? Yeah, 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 yeah. See, he knew. You shut up. And in Minnesota, damn. The, yeah. the, the <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. So aggressive. Hey, man, let's call your parole officer, dude. Be cool, man. Be cool. It's just because you've been talking a lot of crap about me on podcast, bro. Oh, about about how about how you lied said you ran a four three in the forty. I've been around the game too long, Chappelle. Look, I right. love you. All right. Downhill 40, probably. All right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> On a skateboard and a rocket. Yeah. All right. Listen, that was okay. Yeah. You still was, skateboard? Yeah. I still get down. A little too All old for stuff, that, bro. though, huh? Yeah. yeah. Mm hmm. Bigger board, though. Oh, this motherfucker. No, I'm just saying, you can't have a small board <laughs> yeah. and be ollieing and more shit like, at 250 yeah. pounds. More like a. Um, Why you say like a long board? Like Why you pallet. say 250 as if you know my weight? Yeah. Are you not? I mean, you're right, but like, <laughs> dude, 250 like, knows like 250, you, bro. You know? Game recognizes game. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't like that he guessed it right, though. Like, bro, gains recognize gains, dog. <laughs> pounds recognize pounds, dog. <laughs> yeah, man. It's getting thick, ridiculous up in here. Thick, dude. It's getting thick, thick bro. Ridiculous. It's getting fucking cultural, dog. Bro, everybody thinking here besides <laughs> you and Chin and Cat, man. That's true. I'm working on it. I swear. I am. Are you trying to lean out? Yeah, man. Why? I'm to get back to that cheer body. 
Really? <laughs> Are y'all hating? Are y'all hating? Are y'all playing? No, no. All right, you know what? No, I you, it's cool. you know what? You I hey, listen. Either. No, okay. Don't say so cheer body though, bro. Now y'all want to talk to me? you? Ain't making it to your car. You ain't making it to your car. All right. <laughs> oh, That's wow. how it is. This shit got way too talk cultural, yeah. bro. Hey, man. Yeah. <laughs> Note to self. Yeah. Culture corner, way too culture. <laughs> uh, that was all fun and games. He started threatening us, bro. Yeah, fucking hella yeah. urban, bro. Let's get a Middle Eastern dude in here. You feel me? We got to lighten the load <laughs> with a Middle Eastern. We need to lighten it up here. Make fun of that cheer body. Damn. Yeah, oh, no God. doubt, dog. We need more Asians, so. though. <laughs> Yeah, we bro, get we a Brazilian up in this bitch. I <laughs> fucked up, man. We need some namaste, bro. You dark, yeah, it's getting a little. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'll, I'll calm down. Super now. dark arts. You feel me? Yeah, getting dark tests. What y'all saying about dark? I didn't say nothing. Anything, man. We're talking. Y'all about saying something about dark? I'm talking about his tour. Now y'all talking about, about his tour, dog. Now y'all ain't making it home. Tour, dark yeah. arts, bro. <laughs> getting hey. dark. Chappelle is a little dark, bro. <laughs> Chappelle's dark. I'm not talking about his skin either. No, Chappelle's dark. Yeah, I'm just dark. You're dark soul. When you meet him, bro, you set your clock for an hour. <laughs> I've heard so many dark jokes, and that's probably the best one I've ever. Welcome heard. to King of the Sting, dog. I'm 32 years old, and I've been hearing dark jokes all my life, and I have never. That's a good one. Hey, thank I got. You, I gotta give. I gotta give. Good, they're that good, one. bro. He got when they're good. They're good. Y'all gotta take, see Chappelle. I will take that home with me. <laughs> see him in uh, Minneapolis this weekend. Very funny. Do you yeah, know what my mom guys. said? Yeah. She came to the show, and uh, people were talking to her. You know, she was making sure everyone knew she was my mom. Really? And she started heckling. I had to put her in her place a little bit to start the show. But then after, I had to. Damn. But then, I know. It's awful. But Your then family's I, ratchet as oh, fuck, dude. 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 Well, well, my mom was all, hey! <laughs> she had on a bathing suit? Yeah, dude. <laughs> Mom kept going, she ready? Oh, what the damn. fuck is happening, Mom? Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> then they gave me the stand ovation while Mom was clapping, her cheeks in the back. <laughs> like, and... Jesus Christ. I know, dude. How do you think I feel? That's my family. But my mom, uh, someone goes, oh, you watch, you obviously find the kid. You watch King Sting? She goes, I can't. They're too mean to each other. Really? I was like, wait, Mom, come on. We're not mean to each other. Brennan's mean sometimes, I You're think. super mean to me. Really? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I you. think you're way meaner. Let's ask, ask the Chin. culture corner. Who's mean, Chin? What? Chin's not going to say. Derek? Who's meaner? <laughs> Who's yeah. mean? Ooh, man, you guys go back and forth, if I'm being honest. You guys, but Theo, Theo's... Theo's mean. Theo's mean, but it, it, it's funny. And then you're mean, and it's like, mean. <laughs> Just yeah. mean, mean? No, not mean, mean. <laughs> 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 yeah. when, when, when Theo's mean... It's, it's more it's way more mean but it, it's funny yeah and then when you're mean it's way less mean but it's like oh that was just mean yeah wow. <laughs> interesting mean gene they call you interesting <laughs> cat you, you take the same position yeah, chime in cat i agree with that wholeheartedly actually. oh wow. interesting yeah. i think theo has that like um backhanded like southern insult thing just like mm -hmm. inherently in him mm -hmm. like oh bless your heart yeah it's where i'm from insult, we call that an but... asshole yeah <laughs> <laughs> Call it what you will. Yeah. I do think Theo is meaner, <laughs> yes. but because the humor kind of softens the the punch line. We let it, we let whereas it roll. Like, yeah, you're not as mean, but it's like, mm. oh, that's just, okay, mm. that's me. Interesting. Mm. You're both assholes, though. <laughs> now that's, that's what I'm fair. talking about. Let's start this yeah. episode. Dude, it's good to be back. How soon will Kat sues us is what I want to know. <laughs> that's what I think about it every night. Well, let's ask her. Every night before I go to bed. <laughs> let's ask her. Okay. Do you guys want a two-week notice before I do so? Or? <laughs> nah, nah, just hit me with it, man. Okay, yeah, he'll gosh. put it in hit his Hit me sack. with your best shot. <laughs> Time to buy Theo more pants. If you get a King and Sting shirt, whatever you get, maybe send your mom a T freaking set. T -Pain album? Yeah, yeah maybe yeah. send a TP. I don't know what your mom's into, but use ShipStation.com. It's the fastest, easiest, most affordable way to manage and ship your orders, bro. Yeah, you got a wigwam for your wig mom? Send her that. On ship station. Send Ships. your dad a slinky, bro. Yeah, dude. Send your dad one of those uh, electric cooters, you know, that you can plug into the wall. Oh. Here's the, the thing. Flashlight? No matter what you're selling, if you're selling it through Amazon, Etsy, your own website, whatever, you're selling cracklings, you're selling hair barrettes, you know what I'm saying? You're selling new tire treader, chains. Tortilla the, chips. Yeah, whatever. Worms. Yeah. Sea ships. monkeys. Yeah. ShipStation brings all your orders into one simple interface. Dude, no wonder ShipStation is the number one choice of online sellers. You'll ship more in less time with the best rates, period. CBD, EBD, um, 
DBD. DBD, bro. <laughs> they got it all. You could ship anything. No wonder ShipStation is the number one choice of online sellers. Said that, bro. And right now, I'm saying something new. Okay. King and the Sting listeners can try ShipStation for free for 60 days. Whoa. Dude. 60 days. That's Use the code CAT. Yep. There's no risk. You can start your free trial without even entering your credit card info. Yep. Visit ShipStation.com. Click on the microphone at the top of the homepage and type in KA. T-S. ShipStation, enter offer code CATS. ShipStation.com. Make ship happen. Someone's got to pay for Brennan's coffee habit. Oh, man, I used this yesterday, dude. Me too, yep. bro. You talking about that Postmates? That Postmates. Who doesn't use Postmates? I don't know. Lepers, probably. People with lepers. Lepers. Yeah. Leper. Either way, Postmates is fantastic. Maybe you want red wine at 4 p.m., sushi. You want a burrito. Maybe you want cookies. Yeah, maybe you want to listen to some Timberlake and just cry yourself a river, you know? Yeah. But might as well have a snack while you do it. Maybe you want to listen to Michael Jackson be bad and yeah. eat a bunch of cupcakes. Yeah, dude. Might as well have a snack while you do it, you sad little bastard. Maybe you listen to Big Pun and The Punisher Yeah. and eat a whole cheese pizza like I did the other day. And then tell everyone you're on keto. Listen, Postmates <laughs> is the best. Personal food delivery, grocery delivery, whatever kind of delivery service you want year-round, 24-7, 365 days a year. And it's not just for you. Send a bagel to a couple brothers you know or something. You know what I'm saying? Order up a salad for your ex-girlfriend. Send you know a six-pack to your little crush online. Yeah, dude. Here's some uh, orange crush from my crush. Here's a bunch of Capri Suns for that ass. Yeah. Postmates is giving you guys $100 off and free delivery credit for your first seven days. Start think about it. Think about it. To start your free deliveries, download the app and use the code K-A-T-S 2019. Think about it. That's CATS 2019 for $100 of free delivery credit for your first seven days when download the Postmates app. Think about it now. Do it. Anything you need, anytime you need it. Postmates. Shut up. Okay. Knock, knock. Who's there? Patheo and Brendan. What do we got, dog? Uh, you guys want to start a little debate club? Sure, man. Uh, yeah. How are these things working? <laughs> oh, wow. Up first, we got... Ethan Calhoun. Oh, Ooh, snappy snap. This guy, huh? Ooh, little bumble rumble. What? Well, we oh, need some volume. Shin. Hey, don't blame me. Audio guy. This is my favorite guy. This is basically... <laughs> Wait till he starts talking, bro. This is me. <laughs> it's probably me in a couple of years. <laughs> yeah, let's be real. This is Hawaii. <laughs> this is Theo in Hawaii in four yeah. years. <laughs> Aloha, brother. <laughs> Aloha, bro. We're doing it from freaking... Dude, you got to go to Maui, dude. I've been there, bro. No, you have not, bro. I asked nobody seeing you, dude. <laughs> <laughs> nobody Have you done stand-up out there? Huh? No, oh I'm going to go do it soon. Yeah. We should go do a tour over there. We should. Dude, it's we so awesome. King, that's where we should do our first King of the Thing at. Yeah. Hawaii. Yeah. Let's go idea. to those islands. I think they want stand-up, though. They don't want a couple of goofs fucking screwing oh. around. Yeah, you might be right. They want both, man. You guys are both goofs. Yeah. Have you been to Hawaii, Derek? Once with the fam. Oh, wow. Really? Mm -hmm. During 9 oh. 11. Whoa. Yeah, so whoa. Oh, oh, wow. Damn, bro. Wow. You're going to throw that at us? Deserters. I mean, right? Hold on. Wow. What Way to represent, are? bro. I don't want Derek's family in my foxhole. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Damn, bro. And I got to miss like two months of school because we couldn't fly back. Damn. Oh, so everybody damn. had a different experience during that, you know, during that time. So it was a good time for you. I had a pretty. I was balling out, dude. Really, only for you is good. Yeah, time. I was like, this is awesome. Wow, huh? <laughs> when the shit hits the fan, the postings go to Hawaii, <laughs> bro. That's shady. Derek bro. giving shout outs to Osama. That's <laughs> fucking... wow. Wow. Man. And what'd you guys do during 9 11 and stuff, Kat? I, I gathered around a TV while I was at school and we all watched it. How old and were the you, Kat? Were uh, I was, I think, like a fir in first grade. Wow. Uh, too damn. young to be turning the TV baby. for the kids, man. Huh? Too, too young to turn on the TV for kids seeing planes wreck into buildings. That's true, isn't it? Yeah. Chappelle, what were you doing? I was late for school. So you missed all of it? <laughs> <No>. Yeah. <laughs> I woke up and I said, where's New York? <laughs> oh, oh, wow. I was 14. <laughs> Apparently went to a public school. <laughs> what, state, what state were you in? Arizona, man. Oh, wow. Yeah. What part? Mesa. Oh, wow, oh, huh? Yeah. Damn. The big oh, M. Huh? Yeah. Fucking Chappelle's a straight-up illegal alien. <laughs> oh, damn, I know bro. I shouldn't be here right now. <laughs> I know, dude. Damn, bro. <laughs> I got that Zimbabwe blood. Oh, yeah, one <laughs> of them. Sheriff Joe country over there, <laughs> Dude. Huh? 
That dude's a gangster. Though. Oh, he, he doesn't mess around, does he? Intense. Is he the one that puts the inmates in the pink suits? Pink suits, and he used to have a thing called Tent City. Yeah. And he would put them in. Well, they got rid of it. Yeah, he'd make him camp. He's not the sheriff anymore. He'd make him camp in the desert all the time. Yeah. And it was like. Yeah, he was like Bobby Knight, basically. Bro, yeah. He was, he was crazy. Yeah, he was wild. He's been the sheriff for as long as I can remember. Is he still alive? He's still alive, but he's not the sheriff anymore. Yeah, I think he got too. Uh, I guess he got too old. He got, or uh, no, he not. He didn't get. They just. He didn't win. Probably oh, wow. too. Wow. He too he mean. would do that for the rest of li rest of his life if he could. Wow. He's yeah. like the warden from Shawshank, huh? Yeah. From Shawshank? Yeah, he was. I rough. ain't seen Shawshank. Damn. Sorry, aggressive. You're aggressive. <laughs> Gotta remember. I'm sorry. I forget yeah, what I'm asking. Remember, man. You're not in the. Yeah, you ain't in the. You know. You ain't in a. Hey, put me, put me in a cheerleading gym. I'm happy. That's what I'm saying. This ain't a cheerleading competition, bro. You know what I'm saying? John, do a couple of cartwheels and come back in. You feel me? <laughs> right. All right, let's yeah. kick this off. We got the volume. Is this Andy yeah. Dick? What's going on here? <laughs> this, is <laughs> this is about where Andy Dick's career is right now. I'll say that. This is our boy Ethan Calhoun. Ethan. Hello, Theo. Hello, Brendan. I gotta say, the two of you guys are the greatest duo since Martin and Lewis. You're far superior to Millie Vanilli or Shields and Yarnell. You might need to look them up. Today's debate club question is quite simple. Zots or Pop Rocks? I know you don't need to look them up. Oh yeah, one more thing. The Culture Corner rocks! Double gang. Buzz squared. <laughs> oh, dude. I want this guy Damn, to be the official dude. mascot. First of all, Kathy Griffin fell off. I'll say that, bro. But not surprising. After First she... of all, I'm not I'm not mad at Carrot Top's new gimmick. That shit is fire. He's bro. pulling candy out of the trunk now? Yeah. Dude, shout out to that guy, Martin and Lewis from... Who is that? Where is he people... from? He's, he didn't say where he was from. He That's the Peace Treaty guys, or is it? Martin is, Lewis? Yeah. I think that was the uh, old comedy guy. Oh, super old school comedy I duo. So. The original comedy right. duo. Who founded uh, America or found it? That's, you're thinking Lewis and Clark. Yes. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's what you're uh, Shout out Lewis and Clark, boy. Zots were the... I'm not too familiar with Zots. They're, they were like the sour. With the, they had like the fizzy middle. No one knows, huh? <laughs> yeah, Zots are a little random. Now, uh, so Pop Rocks all goddamn day. I put them in my mouth. You like them? Oh, I loved them. I Pop loved Rocks, them. huh? Yeah. But did they you were too much them? of a dangerous candy for me, I remember. I remember I had, I had a couple. I think I had two of them. How many are in the package? There's a bunch in the... It's one pack. You can dump a ball in your mouth and just listen to it crackle pop. Oh, like yeah, dude. Yeah, if you want to have CTE later in life. <laughs> I wanted to live a regular existence. So I remember having one or two of the, of the rocks. That's fair. And then choosing not to have any more. And I remember having a lot of Lickamade. Lickamade? Oh, I know. Those Zots remind me of Warheads. That's why I was trying to think of about seven episodes ago. CT my ass. Warheads <laughs> were dope. <laughs> Bro, you, had a, you were wondering something for seven episodes? <laughs> <laughs> or maybe that's Whoa. a sign of CT. Yeah. But it did just hit me, bro. Yeah. Warheads were the <laughs> shit. Ooh, you guys know what I'm talking about. Oh, Chappelle, that. no candy ever, huh? Really? Why? What happened? God damn, that candy dude. mess. It's, it's, it don't fit my aggression. Damn, really? What is it? Like, what do you mean about it? Like, candy? It's is just, just too sweet. Yeah. You, you know? You don't have any sweet teeth. No. Even those front two you got there. Hey, what's up, man? Why you got to do that? <laughs> no, I'm just... I'm just you See, that's the Brendan being mean right that's there. That's, that's, that's mean. That's How mean. is that mean? That's mean. Yeah. That's mean. What? You don't have to point that out. You have great teeth. You know, that's where, not, that's where I draw the line. Yes, I am. No, I, draw, I draw the line. Yeah. What the fuck? You you can yeah, say how am I the bad guy? You, you have can, great teeth. You can literally what say makes anything you... about my skin tone, but when you talk about this yeah, guy, bro, dude, it's damn, a different world. It's a different it's what world. Michael Strahan did with the same oh, teeth. Oh, come That's on. One guy. That's the oldest one in the book. Worst yeah. joke I've ever heard about my yeah, gap. Great. I love your gap. I'm saying who wouldn't want candy? I, so here's my Brendan, thing. R.I.P. R.I.P. Bro, I don't have sweet. I don't have a sweet tooth. I have sweet teeth. I right. love all. All sugar. Do you? You're not a sugar guy? I'll have some. I don't mind like a uh, maybe a creme brulee or something at night. Oh, my God. But, you know, or some uh, a bread pudding, you know? But nothing like a Twizzler or a Red Vine or uh, some runts. I used to have runts when I was young. I remember from, uh, I think, sixth and seventh grade, I would enjoy a good box of runts. Yeah, I feel like runts would be your thing as a kid. I they picture so you with a good. backpack full of runts. We used to play this game, sugar. We put as much sugar as you could in your mouth and try to slap it out of each other's mouths. Oh, little CT young. sugar buzz. <laughs> because you, the moisture would all absorb as much as it could, and so then you were real dried out and trying to beat that sugar out of each other. Damn. Called sugar Sugar boys. beat. 
No, could Sugar be a fun Boys. game. Sugar Boys. It was a game. I'm telling you, it was a game. Yeah, I wasn't just cool. saying a bunch of stuff. No, I'm saying we could do it now. <laughs> okay, no. You get you ever, try, <laughs> nah, you ever put Kool Aid in your mouth? The raw Kool Aid, the powder Kool Aid. Oh. oh yeah, bro. That's living, brother. Yeah, your tongue would be that color for the rest of the month. <laughs> and what'd you guys play back in the home country, Kat? The home country? Well, she's from, a, she's from America. She's from San Jose. <laughs> Um, in my neighborhood, you used to just try to stay out of the way of cholas and ABGs. Oh, there you go. Okay. You run away from those two. And would you eat candy? Or <laughs> uh, I mean, what did well, everyone have? You, shitty childhoods so besides me. If you had, <laughs> if you had candy, they wanted to steal it from you, so you had to run off. Wow. Wow. If you win, you keep your candy. If not, you get your ass beat. You look like you're a kind of fast cat. Uh, fast enough. Yeah. Fast enough. You just look barely. fast. So, so it was a lot of, uh, so it was a lot of gang violence and stuff in the area. Yes, very ethnic gang violence. Wow. Damn, it's super culture in here today. <laughs> this is what you wanted. I know. I... <laughs> this is really what you wanted, That's brother. So funny. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this is what you lobbied for, I, I brother. I thought I wanted this. <laughs> okay. I thought I wanted yeah. this. <laughs> so, Brendan, you just. Oh, man. You know, Derek, can't I tell you, you, you to like write your ideas out before you. You're right. You're right. Bring I just set up. everything up, and then here we are. <laughs> no one, I think the show's going to get canceled. Well, look, dude. Or we're going to get fucking attacked by MS9 or whatever. whoever <laughs> Cat's old neighbors are. <laughs> <laughs> MS9. This shit's getting bad. This shit, I'm worried for us, dude. It was all fun and games. <laughs> just messing around. Dude, it goes to show you what's going on out yeah, there. Yeah, you're right, bro. Uh, so debate... Pop Rocks, but really Warheads for me. Well, the man asked Pop Rocks or Zots, dude. This is a gentleman who spent time to put that together and send that in. That's Zots, man. Who is that? What's Ethan. the man's name? Lonnie? <laughs> Ethan Calhoun. Oh, Ethan Calhoun, brother, first of all. He's so black. <laughs> yeah, he does so black, dude. <laughs> and he might be black. I didn't see the mask. How much of the... Uh, I can't tell what the mask, what all he's wearing. Yeah, is wearing. that a Riddler's mask he's wearing? Oh, his face looks kind of white a little bit. <laughs> I'm not mad at the B, though. The yeah. little Buzz logo on it. Oh, right. You'd be, your... you, you be the president of the fan club if he wants. That's your that's your henchman, Ethan, the Ethan Calhoun fan club right there. What city? Does he say what city he lives he, in? He didn't say. Not a lot no, of details, dude. huh? Yeah. Probably, Probably lives building underground. Bomb. He's a B. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Um, <laughs> Pop yeah. Rocks, though, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, 93% went with Pop Rocks. Because no one knows what Zots are. No one knows what Zots are. Yeah. You should have done Warheads with Pop Rocks. Well, yeah, he should have done a candy from present day. <laughs> <laughs> You know, he should have done a post-1985 sweet. <laughs> you ain't lying, brother. What do you got? All right, up next, we got Daniel Vernon. What up, Theo? What up, Brennan? Huge fan of the podcast. Appreciate what you guys do. You guys are fucking Appreciate it. We, we don't do anything. Uh, I got to say. Matter of fact, I, I think we're both going to lose our job episode. after Brennan, this. Brennan, told Theo he looks like a high school lacrosse coach who fucks all the players. <laughs> Whoa. Ricardo's laughing so hard. You guys are fucking hilarious, dude. Whoa. Get your all equipment, right, kids. Note, I got a debate club for you guys. I re recently went to storage and dug out um, my old gaming systems, and I want to mm. know when you guys were kids, were you on that Super Nintendo? Oof. Were you on that Sega Genesis? Were you getting those coins with Mario? Or were you that Sonic the Hedgehog getting those rings? Yeah. Uh, you also might recognize this little guy. That's the Rat King, baby. Gang, bro. Fighting the Rat Ninja King Turtles. And Ninja Turtles. Yeah. Let me know what you guys think. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz, culture, culture. Culture, I love this culture, guy. huh? Culture, culture. Yeah. You guys are getting a little, all right. Getting a little respect yeah. out there. Might huh? be the last week you're here, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna get shanked in my car. <laughs> but uh, uh, dude, that's what you get. You're I'm bringing right. in violent cheerleaders, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I thought this he was dude. cool, man. Bro, he's the male Lindsay Lohan over there. Bro. He is, bro. <laughs> That Stacy uh, Dash over there. Oh yeah, she just, <laughs> she just hit somebody. <laughs> Did she really? Yep. She's a bad bitch, really. I think I interviewed her one time. Oh, she is bad. Remember her in Clueless? Yeah. She never did anything after that, but yeah. still. Oh yeah. She was that Clueless, dimey dime. She was. Yeah. Stacy Dash. Yeah. I remember Clueless. I think. What else did he ask? <laughs> what this man asked? Oh, uh, what this guy want? Super Nintendo or Sega Genesis? Oh, Dude, Super God. Nintendo, ahead, I think. Sega Genesis. Some weird kid always had the Sega Genesis. To me, <laughs> it was like, what is it? It's kind of shaped weird. It's, it's black. Like, yeah, which is good. 
And, and then you put the cartridges on top. Like, yeah, it was that was bizarre. Joe, Montana football. There was four games. That was no, very bro. bizarre. No, Sega Genesis was dope. Remember, they had Odd World. If you remember that, with mm -hmm. Abe the alien that walked around. They also had uh, like Crash horrible. Bandicoot. Remember okay. that? Oh. But that was later, though, that Crash came out. We're was talking, it later? I'm Don't talking call him the Crash beginning. and he's your friend, though. Okay. That was later that Crash Bandicoot came so out. So they, they originally hit with the Sonic the Hedgehog. Yes. Then they came with Tails, right? NBA Jam. No, NBA Jam was Sega Genesis, I thought. Or uh, Super Nintendo. I thought that was Sega Genesis, pretty sure. What? Yeah. NBA Jams? What was it on? Mer yeah, I don't think you could play NBA. I thought AB NBA Jam started off as an arcade and then yeah, went to... Sega. I think it was Sega. I th I'm pretty sure it was Sega. Really? Wow. Yeah. Well, then, that, then that's the winner. NBA Jam? He's on fire! Remember that? <laughs> yeah. Well, well let's, look, let's look it up. <laughs> Bring that shit up, D. Remember how great that was? And I remember Carl Malone and Stockton. Gary Payton and Sean Kemp. Oh, you could get no. his, you could activate his me. kids Keep if you got me. the cheat code. <laughs> <laughs> it was 11 on two. I'm not familiar oh, with the video God. game world. So. There it is. Jesus baby. Christ, bro. What are you? No candy, no video games, dude. Oh, wow. I was on both systems. I didn't know. It came out hot with both. Mm -hmm. but re And then remember, the Spurs, you could uh, have Tim Duncan and David Robinson. Yeah. Yeah, it was pretty cool. Jordan was never in it, though, huh? Mm-mm. Mm -mm. What, what I else? Think you could get a Boom shakalaka. Yeah. From downtown. I think <laughs> you, could be, you could get a cheat code maybe and get him. Oh, for sure. He's but, on fire. But back in the day, they had double dribble. Remember that game? Yes. Oh. You could shoot a white guy was on the cover, thousand feet away, and facing the other like direction. Yep. <laughs> All of them shot like this. Yep. And then you could face that way and shoot and go. Yeah. Yeah. Worse, yeah. bro. Dude, I liked uh, Contra. That's that's Super Nintendo too. Yeah. Contra was good. Contra was regular Nintendo as well. Left, right, left, right, up, down, up, down, A, B, A, B, select, start. Wow. Infinity you made it through that. You've been practicing, huh? CT my ass, baby. That is yeah. a lot, huh? It was my game, bro. That was my game. Was it? Yeah. Contra, NBA Jam. What else? Uh, Tecmo Bowl. Did you play Tecmo? Oh, yeah. Come on, bro. Yeah, Jeopardy. Oh, yeah. That was All a great game, too. Stuff. Family Feud. Family Feud. They had some good games. <laughs> and, then, and if you want to go PC, if you want to go PC, we got Wolfenstein, Doom. When you're seven playing Doom, was Doom crazy. You shit your pants. That, that <laughs> thing was scary, dude. And then Wolfenstein, Nazi killing. Was it? Oh, yeah. Wolfenstein, bro. I didn't see killing it. Nazis. I didn't see it. It was so intense. I was seven, dad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no wonder your mom's fucking wearing a bathing suit at a comedy show. You, know? <laughs> shit you, ain't, you ain't lying, your bro. Your family's trapping, bro. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Here's what I'm saying is Super NES, dude. Sega Genesis was for somebody that was strange, I felt like, or were... Just different, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because so cause so Sonic was a bit of a beast of a game now. Sonic was a great game, but you never knew anybody that had it. It was always, to me, it was so foreign. My brother always had it, man. He, I don't know where he got him. He always had the new shit. Hey, type in top Sega games, because we're, we're, we're missing one. Because they, I know Sega had... Mm, maybe that was Sega. What was our Street Fighter or Super Nintendo? Streets of Rage? Altered Beast. Altered Beast, I remember that game. Golden Axe. Yeah, they had some... Weird. Oh, Toe Jam and Earl, bro! That's you and me! <laughs> no, it isn't. Bring up Toe Jam and Earl. I'm the big one. You're the skinny one. Toe Jam and Earl? You never played Toe Jam and Earl? Oh, they, look oh, at them. That's yeah. you and me, bro! <laughs> That's you and me! I do remember that. That was a game? Oh, was it? That was Ever. a TV show, wasn't it? Uh, I don't know, but it was a great you're game. You're thinking Ren and Stimpy, man. Yeah, maybe. Dude, you like? and me are Toe Jam and Earl. Toe Jam and Earl. Oh, Dude, man. I remember that. That shit was great. Go back to the other list. This is a throwback memory lane here. Mm, Disney's Aladdin. Get on my face. Sonic That's Knuckles. what I'm saying. The games got real weak. Y'all had, uh, oh, what is that one right there? It came Karate. out hot. Oh, Shinobi. Shinobu? Shinobi. Yeah. The Revenge of Shinobi. And there you go. <laughs> yeah, I got a little. Keep going. Oh, then it was, why did you say Tetris on there? Get on my face, man. Yeah, see, this shit gets weird. It's oh, like, Earth do your Worm, homework. Earth... That's a game. That's a, this shit is horrible, oh, bro. Earth, <laughs> Earthworm Jim was my favorite. Earthworm Jim. That was my bro. favorite. Dude, I think you got molested. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that sounds like. You don't remember Earthworm Jim? Huh? 
Sounds no, like your gym right. teacher. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like somebody molested you and gave your body nicknames, dude. <laughs> you might be right. Yeah, because I didn't even have a Sega. <laughs> yeah, Sega got weird. Yeah. But we would do it all the time. <laughs> Earthworm yeah. Jim was big. Oh, uh, what do we got? <laughs> uh, so I'm going to go with Super Nintendo just because of uh, uh, NBA Jam. I'll go with you know what I'll go with Sega, dude. Just because I hate it and I'm trying to be different. (laughs) Uh, Fifty six percent went with Sega. Boom, you little pussy. Oh wow. Sorry. That was a little. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. I I just got that text from you. (laughs) I just got that text. Can you have his? Can you have your guy text him about (laughs) anger management? My bad, dude. I shouldn't have said that, man. Not you know I'm a fan of both, dude. You know, but you did get you did call it right. All right, boys, little punk my uncle. No, I shouldn't have called you a pussy. I'm okay about the Sega gas. No, me too. Okay. But the reason you called me a pussy is because I said Super Nintendo, you went Sega. Oh, yeah, that's true. But I like both. But I could have just said, oh, you didn't You went, oh, I got it right, you know? Yeah, I could have just said that, yeah. That would have been the nice thing to do. Yeah, sorry. It's all right, man. What else? (laughs) All right, boys, up first, we got Uncle Jeff. This is Uncle Jeff. Goddamn, what happened to Jeff's eye? Uh, Bro, Jeff is a talented musician. You, have, you don't have to see his eye first, okay? Remember when you had an eye patch? Yeah, that shit was cool, man. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. So, oh, that shit was cool. Yeah, well, but now, now you're supportive of it. Yo, I can't say anything about being mean. <laughs> what happened? The guy has his eye patch on. We're, we're supposed to pretend he doesn't. <laughs> to me. You could bejewel that thing up, make it real swaggy on yeah. the streets. Bro, when you see someone that I patch for the first four minutes, dude, it's you eye etiquette, it. bro. Yeah. You ignore it? You pretend they don't have it. Okay. After that, you can talk about it. Okay. <laughs> Let's check out this. All right. Go ahead. He's uh, Jewish. He's a deadhead. Uh, he has aphasia. I think Not that's how- fully dead. One eye, dude. Quick, you guys got to shut <laughs> I, I shit agree. Down, a man. deadhead? <laughs> What is happening, man? Damn, Derek. The guy's That's still cold, living, bro. bro. I think he likes a band, but or that. I don't know. Uh, oh, he you has mean the Grateful Dead. Dead. Grateful Dead. He's a, I could, you got to say that, man. The Grateful Deadhead? Yeah, you can't say a dead head around a guy that, you know, that's eye. eyed out. <laughs> it's a dying head. <laughs> Sorry, Damn. Uncle Jeff. <laughs> he has, a, I'm not, I hope I'm saying this right, a, aphasia or aphasia. And it's the loss or ability to understand speech caused by brain damage. Shout out to our boy. Check. <laughs> <laughs> he never wears yeah. underwear. And... Check. <laughs> Is this guy me? Yeah, the... Is this the future me? Look, the only words he never forgets how to say are shit and fuck. Check. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, dude. That's all. That's Derek also, it sounds like a little bit. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> like, maybe this guy's awesome. Yeah, dude. Wow. That's it, huh? Yeah, that's all we know about Uncle Jeff. Uncle Jeff, man. They, they don't throw in what happened to his eye, huh? No, I think it might have to do with the aphasia, but I'm not 100%. I hope I'm saying that. And right. aphasia also is a girl from my hometown, I believe, as well. Also, most strippers, if you've ever been. Aphasia, and also a Disney movie with Mickey Mouse, that, and he plays instruments. Mm. I think you mean aphasia. Fantasia. <laughs> That's Plantasia? No, that's about racism. No, no, Fantasia. Fantasia. No, you're thinking 12 Years of Slave. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you're thinking of 12 Years of Fantasia. Yes. <laughs> there it is. There it is. Yeah. Plantasia's insane, dude. I don't Fantasia, watch it. I do not The music's watch good, it. but I don't support that kind of shit, man. Do I own the soundtrack? Yeah. <laughs> but I'm not going to watch it again. <laughs> What else we got? Bro, oh, how fucking crazy would that be if there's a musical called Plantasia? <laughs> I mean, I, it would be it, yeah. yeah, it sounds like Kanye West's new CD dropping. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's Kanye's new album, bro. Uh, Chappelle would be the leading lady. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be where the people are. <laughs> See, that'll make me happy. Yeah, that'll there we go, happy. man. Take all the aggression out. <laughs> there we go, bro. Oh, man. Oh, We're on a show tune. Let's fucking turn up, dude. You feel me? Take this bitch to Broadway, bro. <laughs> Bro, we would have the worst Broadway show. No, we wouldn't. Look at Akuna Matata, bro. Oh, yeah, you're right, bro. <laughs> you're right, man. Oh, shit. Uh, Chin can sing, too. Chin, whoa, 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 Chin, would, be, Chin would be lead vocal. We get super culture. Yeah, dude. Let's all throw around the C word, okay? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> 
Damn, man. Up next, we got another Uncle Jeff. This is Let's Uncle Jeff. It. Two from, Jeffs? Yep. This is from Salt Lake. This Uncle Jeff. Well, goddamn, Jeff. I feel like I've met this guy before. I mean, he may have the same barber, apparently. Theo, that's your cousin. Oh, oh wow. Wow. <laughs> That could be my father. Dude. Look, That could be me. Look at the second picture. You see the second one? Uh-uh. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, he looks it. very oh, similar. Yeah. <laughs> dude, this guy is swagtastic. Look at his outfit. He's kinda, yeah, this guy's, this guy's dope. I wish he was my uncle. Damn, that guy's a straight up swag dragon, huh? With that baby that matches that shirt. <laughs> I, I know this is uh, what is this? Rip, uh, That's so pump my uncle. Un yeah, this is freaking drip daddy, baby. <laughs> that, that this uncle's not messing around. Yeah, you know that ain't his kid. Yeah, that's true. That is true. That's his nephew. <laughs> oh, okay, you're right. You're is right. it? Yeah, he's an uncle. Yeah, oh yeah, he's an uncle. I, <laughs> hey, hey, I, I don't like his sinister smile holding that kid though. I tell you that right now. That ain't a sinister smile. That's a swag smile, bro. Yeah, Come on now. He swagged out on the right. Look at him. This is oh. like taking a kid. Yeah, this is like trying to meet a lady. You take the little uh, the Bichon to the park or whatever. Yeah, Bichon? Right. That baby that name ain't friend. Bichon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Bichon yeah. I tell you that much right now. Yeah. <laughs> I know a Bichon. Yeah, Bichon. Yeah, that ain't him. That, that ain't him. him. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't Bichon. <laughs> That ain't that's, that's Tanner. <laughs> yeah, that's Tanner. <laughs> that is Tanner. Hey, what's up? I'm just holding my nephew Tanner. <laughs> that's Chapman. Hey, I, bet, <laughs> I bet that uh, Chapman. <laughs> I bet this dude could dance. I tell you that much. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah he has some rhythm. He looks like dude, the one rhythm. white guy in the band that does the dance with a stick. You know what I'm talking oh, yeah, about? Yeah. <laughs> the one who got it. Yeah, yeah. that guy. That's uh, the, yep. uh, uh, yeah. yeah. Wesley. His name is Wesley. You, hey, you, know Wesley. He went, you know he went to a black college. Yeah, yeah. You know he went to a black college. He went to Grambling State <laughs> Tech. He went to Howard. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude. He went to Dewan Howard College. <laughs> Dwight Howard College? Yeah, Dwight Howard University, bro. That's where he went. That's a hair salon, probably. <laughs> you Dwight don't, learn, you don't learn that in a white neighborhood. <laughs> dude, this is the most yeah, swaggy true. uncle we've had on here. He does have some fire. What else we got? That's it for Punk Monk, boys. Let's see. Give me another Jeff. Something's up. <laughs> <laughs> we got a little relationship advice, guys. Mm, relationship advice. Mm, we always help them. All right? <laughs> Do we? We always help them. <laughs> Bro, we're both ruining our lives. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you're right. <laughs> this is mad. Yeah. I'm going to keep trying, though, you know? Yeah, you're right, though, man. That's true. My attitude needs to change. I'm going to keep trying as well. Let's see if we can help this guy. Matt Farrell asking for help. Remember the one guy that had his wife trapped in the back of the car? <laughs> and, and then asked us to delete the video? <laughs> hey, man. Dude, you submitted it. I didn't think you guys were going to blast me out like that. <laughs> now my wife's family knows. I'm like... You submit the video. <laughs> we didn't ask for it. He had his wife sitting in a child seat in the back, dude. <laughs> and she was like this. <laughs> yeah, she was like, I'm 26. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to that guy. Hopefully she's still alive. Yeah, right, what do you got? <laughs> gang, gang, buzz, buzz, gang, fellas. Uh, my name's Matt. I'm from Waterford, Michigan. So me and my girlfriend have been together for two years. Uh, first, you know, it was great. My girlfriend, man, she is just, she's just so rude and mean sometimes. Yeah, oh, uh, feel you. You know, love her to death. Yeah, uh, this is you me. Know, when she's we do Latin. Into sex, it's good. She's Latin. Uh, but man, just that attitude. Yeah. Just sometimes, man, it's too much to handle. Mm. Yep. I'm not the type of guy, man, to degrade women or talk bad to women. I really sometimes you gotta shake them, them right? Like that. Uh, so, you know, I try not to engage back with her, man, but, you know, she's just rude, really yep. rude and mean, you mm, know, just damn. mean. And, and so, what you know, ethnicity, bro? And, and, and I want to be with her, but it just doesn't seem like anything's going to change the way that she, she reacts to me and treats me, you know? So, need a little advice, gang, gang, buzz, buzz, brothers. Wow. Appreciate it, man. I need more details if I'm going to solve this case, brother. This is first 48. Me and Detective Theo are on it. Mm -hmm. Is this an episode of uh, Hawaii Five-O? It seems... might be, but I need to know what ethnicity she is. Bruh. You know what I'm saying? This, yeah. this is the easiest thing to solve. <laughs> he needs to stop being a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that think? was aggressive. I'm sorry. What's his name, Brad? <laughs> you need to go back to I know, I need work, to go back. Dude. I mean, you need more work. Hey, that's what they told yeah. me in anger management. Stop being a bitch and look at me. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. Well, oh, was that what it was? Do they, do they say you get angry because you're what? Is that one of the reasons why? I grew up very violent. 
But so, but when they say though, <laughs> in anger management, they say stop being. Is that one of the things they tell you? No, nah, they don't say it directly. Right. <laughs> but, but is one of the reasons you were angry is maybe because you were small and like bigger kids were picking on you? So like, yes, yeah, uh, the yourself? bigger kid that was picking on me was my stepfather. <laughs> yeah, dude. Okay, it's getting dark. That's the big kid that was, I did ask that was, for this though. You're right. Bro, I, I, can ha- I can handle the kids at school. Yeah, dude. This is when I got home. I was like, damn, this is a hard fight. <laughs> dude, your dad could fight, huh? <laughs> Bro. Yeah. Yeah. An yep. eight-year-old? Yeah, he can fight an eight-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> that's all he got. Yeah, hey, yeah, but he bro. can't come at me now. That's he can't saying, come bro. at me What's now. What's up now, Pops? <laughs> Let's see it now. Yo, I'll, I'll set, set it, it up. Out to him. I'll I set him. it up. Yo, I, I love him. Where is that taught, He taught me a lot. Yeah. Yeah, I love him. Good. You got that head work right. He's a horrible dude, but uh, I love him. You know? <laughs> I feel you, man. He's a horrible dude. Yeah. But yeah, that guy, I mean, yeah, he just needs some confidence in himself. Yeah, there's confidence, but also, dude, I'll put up with some shit if she's fine enough. I'll put Ooh. up with some shit, bad movies. She might throw a little racist term here and there. I'm like, yeah, I guess. Oh, I'll leave but I put happens. up with it, dude. If she's that fine, man. If that happens, I'll leave the room, man. But you come back. Huh? Yeah, I come back with snacks, dude. Yeah, yeah. hell yeah. <laughs> come back with them flaming Hot Cheetos, <laughs> Pape. Oh, dude. Uh, I, I got to find out if this girl's Latin. Because my girl, meet the, sometime, I'm like, damn. Let's go to a young lady that we have here. We have a young lady on premises, and let's chat with her. Because we See, need some help. Because I, I don't know. Well, I, my, my girl's not the friendliest. Yeah, they're Latin, dude. Yeah, but, but I feel like cats mean to her, man. I feel like mm. you put hands on them, cat. Look, everybody <laughs> likes to date a girl with an attitude problem until they have to date a girl with an attitude yep. problem. People always think it's so fun mm-hmm. to date a passionate. It's like girl on a pit bull. Speaks mm-hmm. your mind exactly, and you don't want a pit bull when it comes to dealing with a pit like bull. Like supporting Hillary, kind of. Yes. <laughs> you're, you're wearing the shirt. You're wearing the shirt till it's time to vote, <laughs> yeah. and you all put exactly. that fucking sticker on like an asshole. <laughs> exactly. You want that pit bull till it's time to do some pit bull shit at the park. <laughs> <laughs> so you throw that. Frisbee and he attacks a family. <laughs> <laughs> Pibbles are crazy, dude, bro. Pibbles are crazy. They're like yeah. felons. They're dude, like felons, you dude. Throw a frisbee, they kill a family of four. It's like they come back wagging tails. Yeah. <laughs> come back with a mouthful of barrettes. You're like, damn, this shit got violent. Um, I'm sorry, Kat, and I think I stepped there when you were when you were talking too. We, what suggestion would you give us? Because yeah, if, if, if maybe the man feels emasculated, it sounds like a little bit. But I feel like a lot of girls do that over time. Because yes. they don't respect them. They yeah, don't respect I think them. over time, over time, it's easy not to respect your significant other. Yeah, you get that dick game right. Yeah. yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know what it is, just well, over time slowly. Well, you take people, you take people for granted. And then you get really <laughs> mean to them. <laughs> Brent you really that was mean. gonna land big, dude. <laughs> yeah, right. you, yeah. get, you get really mean to him. You take him for granted. Yeah. You know what yeah. I'm saying? You do take him for granted. It's you true. Do. You do, man. It's true. You think you're gonna be granted. there every day. Yeah, you hold the fort down. Yeah, you forget why you were with them or what's going on. But what did he say? He said that the girl's mean, and then he, for, first he said she's rude. Then he said she's mean. I'd have to know. Well, I, if she, if she's ethnic though, if they, listen, <laughs> listen, bro. When they're ethnic and they got that attitude, but they got them curves. What about I? Yeah, put Warnos, up with it, bro. Pape. What, what about Eileen Warnos, dog? She was curvy, dude. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I you mean, know? over time, she can't she's handle made... the curves, bro. If you can't handle the fucking lizards, get out the lot. You feel me, dog? <laughs> Eileen Warnos, the number one lot lizard of all time, wasn't she? Remember her, the movie Monster? Yes, she was the oh, number wow. one lot lizard, and she took, she took charge of her life. Yeah. Damn, for instance. Wait, y'all, y'all never, she was a f- the only female serial killer, son. Yeah. Wait, y'all never seen uh, the Tina Turner movie with Ike and Tina, bro? Uh-uh. Hey, oh, Tina was she, Turner was she mean to him? No, good? she beat him the fuck up. Damn. Oh. Well, Whitney Houston, Bobby Brown, I heard it was good fights. <laughs> I did too. Tommy Davidson told me they were good fights. I heard that. <laughs> Rihanna Chris Brown. I'll buy that shit again. I would watch it. She got that reach with the legs, Yeah, too. she did. Heard she bit him. <laughs> yeah. I heard that too. Yeah, she bit him. That's why he freaked out. Dude, I'll tell you this. I'm friends with a ShamWow guy, Vince, right? With who? Vince from ShamWow. Remember oh, him? God, you keep throwing that in my face. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, dude. he got accused of he got accused of hitting a woman one time in Miami. That makes sense. But the woman had bit onto him, like one of those fish on the oh, side like of the tank. sucker fish. Yeah, and he had no way to get her off. So what did he do? He he tried Better to get her sham-wow. off. He tried to order food and stuff. He tried to sham her off. <laughs> 
And uh, and, she and then leave. eventually, yeah, he used a aggressive force hitting. <laughs> and then so it, what happened though? She take a chunk she out of his face. She called the police. Yeah, she took a chunk out of his face though. Yeah. <gasps> so there was a bite. That, hap mark that happened to that uh, soap opera dude who's a dime piece. He had a wife, had a side piece on the side. Mm. Something happened with the side piece. She bit his lip off. Yep. Ooh. That's what you get. Somebody did that to Lester Holt. Bit his fucking lip off, dude. Really? Look at Lester Holt, dude. Here's the number one Dateline episode. Where's your top lip at, Les? All right? <laughs> Let's get a picture of Lester Holt up here, dude. <laughs> I gotta see that. <laughs> really? Yeah, this dude looking for all these mysteries, and somebody uh, Stole right under... his lip right underneath his oh, fucking nose. Wow. Right underneath his nose. <laughs> Hey, type in Lester Holt's lip. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Derek definitely uh, one of the worst. Between Derek and ever. Chin, as far as the Googling skills, never it ain't good. <laughs> oh, wow. They gonna show Ray Black? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. No oh, lip. black man got small lips. <laughs> I know, dude. Bro. He can't Lester, even hold a mustache. Dude, whoa, whoa. Hold on a second. Bro, I don't fucking know if Lester Holt is black, dude. Look at fucking Lester Holt. You telling me that's not a white dude in blackface? Look at him. <laughs> Look Dude. at the fucking picture. I think he goes. I think he goes there. chocolate body twenty four seven. Bro, that ain't a fucking black dude. Look at him. Like Dave Chappelle the white face. Yes. That's black. He black. No, he's not. No, he ain't. Look at that picture with the fucking suit on. Hey, go to his Wikipedia. It says his. Oh, it'll see if it says his parents. Bro, that ain't a. Black that's not a black man. dude. He's not black. Look how long his hair is on the side. Yes, what is dude. he? Uh, he's mixed. Mixed with a lot of white. Yes. Oh, God. Bro, come oh, bro. on, Oh, bro. Okay, dude. all right. You're right about that one. That one. Look at his hair. That's a bit much. <laughs> that's a little aggressive. I thought I was aggressive, but that's aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> hold up. Hold up. Is that him on the, uh, the bottom left there? The same. Uh, this will redeem him. Is that Lester? Uh, that's a black man there. On his rise to the top. Ooh, no. he, he might be like mm. a Michael Jackson case. I don't know if that. I mean, Damn. if you really put Maybe on... he's Sammy Sosa did it. Damn. Yeah, I just... How are you going to Sammy Sosa? What? No. Sammy, Sammy Sosa Sammy gets Sosa. the lotion, so he's white. Yeah, he puts on That's that a real white, thing? the whitening lotion. Wow. Yeah. You, have, you have seen Sammy Sosa lately? It's fantastic. He might be, right he might be a white man. I never thought it in my life. I've, I've seen over probably 600 episodes of Dateline. And, and he, you don't... Oh, I've never thought that until just now. It's like, that just doesn't look like a black man to me. Yeah, that's Wait, fair. what's Sammy look Sosa that doing? that shit. That's the whitest shit you can Damn, do. Damn, right that is. There. That's pretty white. That's, that's also a Hail Hitler sign. So. <laughs> All right, Lester. Yeah, Lester dude, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Unless bro. he has I'm a with... Bible in that left <laughs> hand, dude. Yeah. I'm with Theo on this case, bro. Damn, Lester Holt is white? Damn. Case Saul. Yeah. I was rooting for you, Lester. I was like, hey, man. I was yeah, like, no, he won't hard to paint for a second. Yeah, y'all was, try was trying to take him, but I was like, hey, no, that's he We're trying us. to claim him. He's with me and Derek, okay? He won't even, <laughs> Lester wouldn't even make our culture corner, dude. <laughs> oh, no. No. Lester, way too white for the culture Maybe the corner. Crayola Damn. corner, bro. He got some paint on Wait, what's up with Sammy Sosa? Sam oh, right? bro, you hey. haven't seen him lately? Sam Sam right? Salmon Sosa, they call him. He's turning Salmon Sosa? Yeah. <laughs> Bro, his fucking his ethnicity swam upstream, bro. This shit is gone. <laughs> as far away from the black river as it could get, bro. He is. But he ain't black. He was Sammy Sosa. Well, he was yeah. Puerto Rican, black. Yeah, he's a lot like of black, uh, Dominican, yeah. black Tino. Yeah, I get mistaken for Dominican all the time. Do you really? I could see that. No, a darker Dominican. No. Yeah. Like I, I probably, probably like probably maybe like if you had a times. baseball hat on. No, kind of like four the, times, like the Batman of the Dominican Republic, kind of a little bit. <laughs> the yeah. Batman of the Dominican. I well, can see that a little bit, man. He has the best dark joke. Yeah, dude. <laughs> He's just like, <laughs> yeah, Brennan's just racist, dude. I know. <laughs> oh, I'm the racist one. Yeah, he was making fun of my gap and shit. I'm like, oh no, dude. I made a reference how cool your gap is. Yeah. All of a sudden, I'm the bad guy. <laughs> Meanwhile, he's friends with Shamu, beats women, <laughs> and the head of the KKK. Duke used to spot him on the squat rack, but I'm the racist. Okay, okay. On bench press, you asshole. Dude. Okay, and he's a nice guy, bro. Yeah, he's different. Swap now. fucking supplements okay. with the Duke, and I'm. Racist because my dad got a little flavor in the okay, green room. And my mom twerks. Yeah. All right. I see how it is. What else we got? D. Get us All out right. of here. Get me out of here. We man. got a couple. We got a couple rip my drips, boys. Uh, up first, this is Dave from New Jersey. Oh, damn. oh shit, Dave. Yeah, Clearly up. a fan of women's lingerie football. WWF or WTF, dog? No, that's what would women. Oh, that's that Wonder Woman. He's from New Jersey, and they got bored and just threw on his girl's Halloween costume and wanted you guys. Oh, he's playing. Oh, I like this dude. Yeah. Respect. Yeah. Son. It's just for y'all. 
Oh, that's dope. Oh, damn, bro. Nice tits. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, one of them nice. I can't. That other one's far from us. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> one of them's thick. The other one I can't tell. Yeah. Got that big gap between the tits. <laughs> Whoa, dude. Again. Jesus, Say man. Again. Yeah. Say it again. Yeah. Say it again. Oh, dude. I can't say gap, man. Say it again. I like this guy. Now, is that uh, Adamic Sue for the... Because <laughs> he's balling this season. That was A1. That was good. That was good. Some people get it. Dude, yeah. Cold the corner gets it. Adamic Sue. G, I think <laughs> this guy, bro. I love it, dude. That's what I'm saying. Put on your wife's shit and go out there and do some bad shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, show her who's boss, man. Yeah, she go don't out there and be fucking break a tits. couple car windows or something. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Dude, get on Tinder with that outfit. Oh, See no. what's up. Sure, fucking, what's up? Yeah, rear naked choke a fucking cocker spaniel, bro. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Bro. Change the neighborhood up, bro. Slap a hound dog around. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying, bro. Live your life, boy. I like this dude. That's what I'm saying, dude. What else we got? What's this guy's name? Walter? Dave. <laughs> Dave. Dave. Yeah. Dave? Hell yeah. Dave from Big New Jersey. Dave. Now, just, now, hold on. Here's something you got to think about. This is a girl's Halloween costume, and she fits into that? She's thick. Oh. Is she? <laughs> She's thick. No, I don't think so. He's he didn't ruin there. the outfit. <laughs> He's not going to put it on rip or shit. She I yeah, bro. Oh, wow. She sounds like a beautiful lady, and she sounds like... Sounds like they both play D-Tackle for Oklahoma. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he, uh, Chappelle just got excited. He just fucking... Yeah, picked, I was like, oh, I get the cheer. He put, yeah, he just got his cheer outfit. <laughs> You're like, okay. Sidelines. 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 <laughs> Sidelines. <laughs> Right and all that, yeah, yeah. Uh, swerving on that, yeah. swerving on, swerving that. on that hash mark. <laughs> Skateboard, yeah. Did Skateboard. He, is this a wig that he has on or not? That's the tough part. I can't. I, I think that. I might would be assume his that's hair. a wig. I don't it know. Looks like a wig, but I'm not sure. Actually, it might be him. That might be his hair. Yeah. That's cool. I don't know. He's dope. Though. I'm a fan. He's a bad bitch, man. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> Damn, bro. Hell, this dude. hell of a player. What else we got? We got uh, up next, we got Robert Vitalia. This is Robert Vitalia. Oh, nice. Brandon, this is right before your show in Houston, big dog. Never been so close to canceling a weekend ever in my life. He yeah. said he's super glad you didn't cancel. He'd have been fucking pissed, and he's had a great time with us I that night. I knew it. Yep. I figured mm, if I had canceled, I would have lost the entire crowd. I mean, look what he stood in for you. True. <laughs> However, CNN, chill the fuck out. I got there bone dry. Really? There's nothing there. Houston does that a lot. They're like, oh, it's flooding here, and you get there, and everybody's doing fine. Yeah, there's fine. I yeah. drove down from Austin that morning. I was all worried I'd have to cancel. I got there. Nothing. Really? No, nothing. Hmm. I guess it was on the outskirts. But CNN was like, Houston's underwater. Yeah. It showed like a Kia floating by upside down. <laughs> I was like, damn, I don't know if I should do this. But I did it. That's fear tactics they got. They did yeah, the same thing with the Portland Proud Boys. Well. <laughs> <laughs> what is Proud Boys? Uh, so we want to take this one? I got in trouble last time. Uh, pr I think they're like a group of white dudes. No? No, no I'm saying, go ahead. I, no, it's oh, fine. But I think it. they're a group of white dudes who hate everybody. But like, I don't know. There's, there's so many Antifa groups now. and there's they're Proud, Proud Boys. Boys. And they don't like each other. Oh, they don't like each other. So, yeah. they're, so they're rioting out there, this huge riot. So everyone's like, don't come to Portland that week. It's going to be trouble. Chin came. I was worried for his safety. Mm -hmm. um, Were you worried? <laughs> Were you worried, Chin, or not? Yeah, a little bit. Do you have feelings of worry ever? It was a, it, it was a little weird down there. We were all there. Shows yeah. were great. Yeah, Those I brought the whole culture corner with me during the Proud Boy rally. Damn. And then I looked Mexican, but then I took a picture in front of the whole freaking SWAT team and the Proud Boys like this. Did you? Yeah. yeah. I, Who's your team? Proud Boys more or Antifa? <laughs> if I had to pick, yeah. if I had to pick, ooh. <laughs> if it's a game, yeah. If it's a game. Them Proud Boys were wilding, bro. But that, Antifa has more players and probably more quality players. Who's going to punch it in from the one, though? A t Antifa. Really? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. And they didn't seem to be affected by the tear gas. So that goes a long way. <laughs> really? With me. Yeah. They actually encouraged it. <laughs> oh, damn. Uh, what's his question? No, he just wanted you to rip that drip. That's all. Oh, hell yeah. That, that rain drip, Doug. That rain drip. Looks like Al Madrigal a little bit. Little guys. <laughs> Also like the kid growing up uh, from It that gets murdered in the first minute of the movie. Oh, he looks like a son. He does look like a son. He does look like a son. It looks like he has a fake weight. nose and glasses on. <laughs> 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 right? It does look like a son put on like about oh, 40 pounds. 
<laughs> Looks like Hassan if he actually ate meals. Yeah, what is Hassan still fasting for? <laughs> we don't know. I, we, I'm confused on their culture. I re really don't know, but no. he's fasting 24 7. He won't eat. Oh. <laughs> he won't eat. Oh, that's a legit thing. Yeah, it just says fast. praise Allah and then just <laughs> keeps fasting. Yeah. yeah. Fast, man. Sometimes he'll turn on the oven and just get in there for like a half hour and just kind of, and then he'll come back out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Just to smell what it's like in there. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's very strange, it's man. It's weird. It's weird. Okay. All right, boys. End it with a little king and her sting it. Let's yeah. do it. Yeah, wrap it up. Uh, God, dog. It's the king and the sting. No one's first. charging this thing anymore, huh? <laughs> we got Austin Barrett. This is Austin. Praise God, brother. What up, Theo? What up, Brandon? It's Austin from Nebraska. Got a king and her sting it for you. Cliff jumping. Let me know what you think. Oh, in jeans? Bro! No! In jeans? <laughs> Damn, that's gangster. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz. <laughs> wow. Oh, Great God. video. Shout out to Nebraska. Where is dude. he in? In Kuala Lumpur? Where was he at? He's in Nebraska. Oh, Nebraska. Yeah. You know what? Hear that correctly. Uh, Cliff jumping for me is going to be a hard pass. I did in college at um, Table Rock in Missouri. Mm -hmm. And it's a place where everyone jumped off. It was the middle of the summer, right? And so all my friends are there. So you take a boat there. And I was like, oh, that's not that high. Mm -hmm. Like, really? You do? I'm like, yeah, I'll do it. We hike up there. It's high as shit once you get up there. Yeah, it's so high. I didn't want to do it. Wow. All my friends jump. I'm like, damn, I do not want to do this. And then some drunk dude, I'm like getting ready to go. And there's, a, I was trying to impress these girls. And the guys on the boat with the girls goes, jump, pussy. Mm -hmm. And I was like, no, well, was now me. I got to do it. That was you. <laughs> I knew it. I, I, thought, I, I yeah. thought it was you, dude. I jumped. Your boy belly flopped. Ooh. Hit my face. Contact went everywhere. Water in my ear. Awful experience. Ooh, Never do it kept again. Keep your eye open when you fucking land. No, it forced it. Boom. Oh. Contact. Boom. You got to have stronger eye. Off. Yeah, you're right. You it's not for me, dude. Your eye, eyelashes need to be stronger. But listen. For your eyelids. You got to be a special you have weak kind eyelids? of. Weak eyelids? I think so. Let me see. Close well, your eyes. No, no, don't do that. Don't squint. Just close them. There you go. Yeah. And close your mouth, too, when you do it. That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. That's how I sleep, bro. Oh, this ain't God. this ain't Craigslist, brother. <laughs> Just close your eyes, man. I thought I was on a Tinder date. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. I like close your eyes. He's like, <laughs> like damn, bro. Tighten up, bucko. Oh, You've changed a lot, man. I have, dude. <laughs> oh, changed, do you know what I did before I went home? I'm not afraid to admit this. I had to use a little bit of Just for Men. I thought about you. You ever use Just for Men? <clears throat> just for Men for I'm whack, not talking uh, about your Tinder profile. Taking hair off. <laughs> no, it's for uh, dyeing your hair. Like oh, it's yeah. just a little brush. Because mm -hmm. I had all these grays here. I'm like, damn, I don't want to go back home. Everyone's like, damn, we have all these gray hair, stress. So I just put a little little color there, dog. Oh, a little wow. color there. Can't even tell, man. Can't even tell, right? Uh -uh. <laughs> my mom likes that I'm growing my hair out. Yeah, it looks cool, man. And she said, she said you should grow it like Theo. I said, Mom, he was born with that haircut. Or it's a wig. We don't know. Shh. <laughs> It's a wig. But it's, <laughs> but it's dope. Dude, one of my favorite, they used to have that TV show, Honey Boo Boo, and one of my favorite things yeah. on it. They had a store in their town called, shh, it's a wig. <laughs> <laughs> that was the name of the store, bro. What a great fucking name, dude. Bro, Austin, I think that's great, man. If you can be that, you know, if you got that kind of resiliency in your body and stuff like that, and your body can handle hitting the water like that. Dude, I remember doing a 60-footer when I was young. Did you grow up doing that in <clears throat> New Orleans and stuff? Some, dude. I'll tell you what happened. When I stopped doing it, they had a guy named Jeff in our town who jumped off of, this was probably 95 feet, dude, off of an overpass in interstate and hit a fucking boat. He didn't see that a boat was coming by. Mm -hmm. And fucking and what happened to him? right into that bitch, dude. Did he start shattered, the boat? shattered one of his legs. No, lived. Shattered one of his uh, fibulas or something. Jesus. Tibulas. And, um, and then you guys stopped doing it? And he was never the same. Actually, he was never the same really before it. I don't think he was never. He was never. <laughs> that makes sense. But after he hit that boat, he was that also. That defined him. That yeah. gave him a reason. After he also hit that boat. He's like, oh, now I'm crazy. People were yelling, bro, bro, don't. There's a boat, you know? And he still went. Dude, if you can be this uh, Husker Tarzan and keep jumping off the fucking uh, cliffs, do it, man. That's yeah. just dangerous. It's not for me. He made my cheer team. Woody, could you do that? Can you do that? Into the water? Yeah. Bro, I gotta get in the water? Yeah, that's the... I see, I, and I, see, see, and you guys think I'm being mean. I don't want to be racist. I was just going to say, can you swim? Oh, okay. You know what? 
Listen, well, I can swim, yeah. okay? All right. I just don't like the water. Oh, dude. Whoa, whoa, you can't whoa, whoa. be violent know, against the water. It. A lot of black guys, when they get in the water, they get violent against it. Yeah. yeah. That's why they go down. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, it's like they win the first round, yeah. they win the second round. Dude, a, life, a lifeguard round, had to, a lifeguard That's why I call it the deep water round. <laughs> Dude, a lifeguard <laughs> had to come get me in Huntington Beach. Wow. I got stuck. Yeah. Can you, can you swim or no? Yes, man. No, I'm just curious. Some guys can't swim. D, can you swim? I can swim. I'm actually, I, can you swim? Yeah, I could, yeah. Come on, y'all. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> you can't swim, bro. I'm telling you, you're built like my brother. He can't swim with shit either. All right, yeah, I, that floating shit is hard. Yeah. It's tough. That doggy <laughs> paddle is no pump. That floating shit is hard, dude. dude. Cat, can you swim? <clears throat> yeah, Cat, Cat can, can swim, swim, dude. Cat yeah. can swim Cat's all day. Like a stingray. I can you swim, Chin? Here. Chin can swim? <laughs> Don't be like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow, fast. If you float, that's when I have the worst time. Yeah. Okay, I'm not the only one. But yeah, swimming uh, Yeah, swimming makes this, swimming sometimes makes me nervous a little bit. Oh, I love it, man. I love uh, it. I look like a seal in the ocean. What else we got? Last one, boys. This is Aaron Martin from Lexington, Kentucky. This is Aaron. Okay. Killer brows. Hey, boys, I have a question for you. God, Dating damn. somebody in law enforcement. Oh, you a badge bunny. King it or sting it. Ooh, huh? That's a badge bunny, Doug. Oh my God. That's a badge bunny. I ain't never heard that before. No? That little cuffalophagus boy, yeah, yeah. you feel me? Little bullet bunny up in this bitch. <laughs> oh, bullet bunny, dude? Bullet bunny, bro. Those are people that get murdered, bro. <laughs> Look at these bullet bunnies over here. That's when you're about to sell rabbit meat to someone. All right, we'll call her a badge bunny. <laughs> okay. uh, law enforcement, hey, know what you're signing up for. Yep. You're going to see some dark arts and bring it home. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. What did she say? Would you uh, Dating someone in law enforcement, king it or stink it? I would date someone in law enforcement, I think. Oh, I'll tell you this. I made love to a girl one time in Guantanamo Bay, and she had a grenade. <laughs> that she that me, grenade. That she let me hold. And you're not talking about her tits, are you? No. I'm not talking a about real one. grenade? Yeah. She had a wow. real grenade in the trunk of her car. Pretty why, cool, why, man. why did she have a grenade? You get one, dude. If you're in the military, you fucking get a grenade. Oh, I dude, guess. I bet. <laughs> she was in the military. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. you didn't oh, say that. Yeah, Sorry. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, she was you, in the military yeah. working on Guantanamo <laughs> Bay. Dude, it sounds like you fucked up. Spy, bro. <laughs> yeah. You know, bro. Yeah. yeah you know, that shit. Keep touching me, dude. Get away oh. from me. Yes. Wait for me, you animal. Yeah, yeah, yes, Badge Bunny. Keep doing your thing. We're going to press charges against you, boy. <laughs> Sorry, dude. And I mean all of us. <laughs> <laughs> me in the culture corner, brother. The whole culture <laughs> corner. Yep. Oh, You're like James Bond, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Aloha. Yeah, grenade is the only thing that it blasted. What else we got? Oh, that's it, boys. That's it for this one. Jeez. Woo, man. Good to see you, dude. Yeah, man. Good to see you too, bro. Good to see you, Culture Corner. <laughs> culture, 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 culture. Chappelle's first time. Chappelle, that's the worst that's cheer that's ever. ever. He went like this. I expected a little more. Yeah, I expected dude. we go culture. <laughs> yo, yo, Brendan had that on lock right now. He'd make my team. He'd make my team. I sat on the sidelines during uh, my college year, so I watched a lot of cheer. <laughs> Not the dudes, homie. Not the dudes. <laughs> He just gets it. You just get it. That's, yeah, bro. That's what's up. <laughs> a lot of steroids though in the che male cheerleading community. Was what? There? <laughs> For I cheer? Remember, yeah. Why not? You know I what? Remember when you I know what? Actually, you are right. You are right. Like the dudes that like stunt and just, ones. just lift the girls. Yeah. yeah. They yeah they do. Well. They, they they call them the Anavar kids. Who? Yeah. Anavar. It's like a type of steroid. I yeah. Think. Oh, I was like, what's that word? Yeah, yeah. it's a steroid. I never heard that. Don't act like, don't act like you never took it. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I remember, and I, and I'm just, uh, I mean, a lot, because you don't see a real weak guy doing a holding a lady up. They don't let that guy do it. Timothy don't get to do it. <laughs> a little Timmy out there <laughs> sharing with the with the horn. Yeah. No, no, yeah, bro, only the cock diesel yeah. boys tossing them bitches in the air like Ooh. that. Huh? Yeah, dude, where's the diversity? I want to see the guy in the wheelchair out there, you know, balancing, you know, who doesn't have any feeling in his arms, balancing a chick on his head. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like a seal. <laughs> yeah, dude. That's Let's get saying, the guy bro. with one eye out there, bro. Yeah, dude. Let's, Let's mix it up. Yeah, bro. Let's get it. Yeah, dude. Let's get it. Dude, you go to the South, there. the cheerleading squad's more athletic than the football team. Yeah, they suck at football, Ooh. but they'll play the shit out them drums. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You ever Dude, seen Nick Cannon's uh, movie? Yeah. Drumline? Dude, there's some there's classic some, good there's great some colleges uh 
that that have their cheer teams, they have more titles than any other thing on the campus, like other schools. Oh, for on the sure. Campus, yeah, it's cheerleading, know? though, you know? Yeah. Cheerleading's big, man. Wait, what you trying to say is cheerleading, though? What, I'm what just you... saying it's cheerleading, dude. What in you, the South, you... it's different. It's a big deal down there. Dude, it's a big deal in the South. I cheered, here, here. I, cheered, I cheered in Texas and I cheered at uh, Louisville. See that? Kentucky. See, that counts. That's the yeah. South. Well, dude, I'll say but this. But you do it in California, you're a gay man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you have more rights as a cheerleader out here. Yeah, yeah you have right. more rights, more rights. You can go to any rights. bathroom you want. More rights, more rights. <laughs> yeah. Dude, when we would travel for games, bro, I couldn't get out of the van for like certain cities. Really? Why? Yeah. They would murder me. Why? <laughs> Look at my skin. <laughs> oh. When was oh, it? Hey, were you, were you cheerleading in 1991? I mean, I know, right? <laughs> were you cheerleading in Watts in 1991? Hey, that's what, that's yeah, what my you coach said. Selma High School, dude? <laughs> Bro, I think you got some bad intel, man. Uh, well, that's what my coach <laughs> told me. She was like, okay. you can't get out the van. I'm like, why? White? Yeah. That's that white. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's, that's that white. That's that white. That's that white. Yeah. South. That guy's oh. thinking, oh, I'm gonna cut, I'm gonna protect him. That guy's staying up at night watching the blind side on his phone and shit. <laughs> that, that Pretending coach is your wrong, name's bro. Precious and yeah, shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, bro, that guy's crazy, dude. Hey, shout out to Precious, though. Oh, yeah. yeah. But, dude, you missed out. Y'all were at a Hardee's, bro. You should have got out the van and fucking got a biscuit. Bro. Man, I used, like, yeah. man, I used to go to the boondocks sometimes, man. I didn't care. <laughs> you know, man. like, I was fine. No one fucked with me. But they said when when we were traveling to like different schools, your through, co your coach watched too much. Remember the Titans? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know it was like literally two thousand nine. I'm like, I can't get out the van. It's two thousand ten. No gave a fuck. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the sound. I was like, let me get out. <laughs> yeah, bro. He had a fucking underground railroad license plate. On the van. You're like, damn, bro. This guy's got fucking. I sat crazy. in the back of the van too. Yeah. It sounded like this guy was crazy, bro. Yeah, bro. Yeah, it sounds like. Yeah. He was yeah, super racist, dude. Coach was racist, man. Yeah, yeah, I think your coach was embarrassed of you. The van was <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it was just that. Yeah, man, dude. Yeah, you got to get out the van, right? yeah, dude. <laughs> Stick up for yourself, man. Yeah, I know. Take a seat in the front row next I time. I didn't know I'm from Arizona. I didn't know. I was like, okay, I never yeah, been in the South. Fine, <laughs> Wow. Oh my God, that's hilarious. Wow, that's fantastic. Yeah, dude. Theo, uh, where you at, dude? Give some dates so we can get the fuck out of here. Man. I don't know, man. I don't know after that either, bro. Uh, I'd like to track down your coach and have a conversation. <laughs> um, where am I going to be, dude? I'm coming up next on the 8th. I'm in Cleveland, I believe, so I'll let you know that. Uh, on the 8th, I'm in Cleveland, Ohio. Then on the 9th, I'm in Indianapolis. And uh, after that, uh, the the twelfth, I'm in Milwaukee. Those places, I think, still have tickets. Uh, then you're so, Pittsburgh too. Get some of that. I'll be in Pittsburgh this weekend, actually. It's this weekend, huh? Both of us are in Pittsburgh, bro. Yep, that's crazy. I'm there Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Are you? Yeah. Damn. I'm in Pittsburgh this week. Pittsburgh Improv. Maybe we'll link up there. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see what's um, up. Man. And then following that. Uh, I think it what's the uh, Philly is the nineteenth through the twenty first. I'm in Philly, and then in uh, November I'm in Dallas and Salt Lake City. But then uh, I just launched my new tour, Fifty Shades of Brown, international, all over London, Dublin, Sweden, all over. What about the King and the Sting tour that we're supposed to take place? Let's do it, Doug. Well, we we're just talking about Hawaii. But then you were like, no, they don't like that out there. You no, look I don't too think Hawaiian. they don't like it. But I just think we should go there with comedy. But together, well, we should go there. Be fun. Oh uh, yeah, I think we should go over there. There's not a lot of people that go over there and do comedy. There's not just Joe Coy. Yeah, and sells like seventy thousand tickets. Dude, people loved it, man. There were so many people out there. Who were super cool. Loved you. Just people that were just super friendly. Oh, they're the best. Asking about the show. That's why I go out about there, stuff. Bro. It was great, bro. Oh, nothing better, dude. So good out it's there. Good to be back, man. Good yeah. to see you got a tan and a Hawaiian shirt. Dude, I feel good, bro. Love it. Uh, Pittsburgh this week. Philly next. We're out. We're out. Oh, oh. It's the king of nothing.